Hello, everybody. Hi, guys. Welcome to our very first attempt at Bloodborne. Well, my very first attempt. His at first attempt at Bloodborne. I finished Bloodborne last week. Mm. Uh, f killed all of the bosses. It was. And yes, I mean all of them, even that one at the end that you have to, like, do that weird, stupid thing to fight that makes no real sense. Mm. Um, so basically the 2000... Yeah. The 2001... The 2001-like ending that you told me about? Hmm? Yeah, you told me it was like some sort of, like, ending, like, 2000... Oh, spoilers, guys. Yeah, actually, yeah, 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 this is, this is spoilers. Just, uh, God damn it, not even a minute into the video, we're well, we the spoilers. Well, we didn't actually spoil anything yet, except that there is a secret, really? sort of secret box. Well, people, well, you know, people get up in arms about that stuff anyway. Even That's if true. Hint if you anything. don't like spoilers, then for the next, like, minute and a half, just, like, cup your ears and scream as loudly as you can. Let's ignore... Um, <laughs> yeah, just go ahead. Okay, so, at the end of the game, at the end of Bloodborne, uh, uh yeah, you just... can fight German the you, you fight German the Hunter, or you let German the Hunter kill you. <laughs> Uh, if you fight German, then after he's dead, this f fucking weird thing just comes down from the sky and will eat you alive. If you have uh, eaten three pieces uh, of the what's of something I can't remember what it's called, but it's three things that you can get in the game. And if you eat, if you consume that's all that's... three of them, then when it tries to eat you, it gets repelled by some sort of energy. And then oh, you fight it, and once you defeat it, you turn into a little, uh, a little great one, a, an infant great one. Yeah. I didn't know that it was an infant great one, right. so when I did it, I was just like, I am a squid now, because right. that's exactly what it looks like. Right, hang on, man. first you just gotta listen to yeah, this. Yeah, sure. Um, I, I think it's been probably about a minute and a half, so I won't spoil anything more. But yeah, that that ending just real like, I, I, that was the ending that I got. The yeah, one I'm that going with that. Weeded me out. Yeah. Sure. Um, all right. So for those of you who don't know, we are going to start to make the Godmother. Yes. The Godmother. We're looking for the Godmother. Uh, uh, She's very disappointed in you. <laughs> you have, you have made the bad thing about. Do you think you can pick up our voices, all right? Yeah, I did. I just picked H voice. Hmm? I just picked H voice. No, H. can that pick up our voice? Uh, yes, it can. It can. Yes. From here. Yes. Good. Oh, okay. It could pick up our voices from over there. That so. looks disturbingly close to her being naked. <laughs> I have to admit, my character annoyed. Oh yeah, darker. Not quite that dark, but darker. No. Like this. No. I said darker. <laughs> Go two up. No, to the right. Right. Yeah, right. right. Two up. I I'm think that looks close to closest to Italian. You think it looks closer to, uh, to Marlon Brando? No, but this is a woman. Okay. No, uh... Marlena Brando. <laughs> Actually, now that we're making a girl, I should just call her Carlina. Yeah, oh uh, yeah. Well, yeah, we call, this Carlina. Dude, we call this dude, um... Carlino. Carlino, but now that she is... Now that she's the godmother. Actually, don't even call her Carlina, just call her the godmother. <laughs> That's pretty good. She, right, she, the canon can be that she's called Carlina. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay. Alright, so what we got? Similar face, face, shape. Oh. oh. See, I was I know a couple of people and I was one of them who were really disappointed in this character customization because it's not as psychotic as it was. Mm. Well, you um, can get pretty hardcore, I guess. You but... No, in Dark Souls... Uh, in Dark Souls, there was actually a thing that I did a couple of times, and I'm not sure how many people realize it, but um, in Dark Souls, if you uh, uh, set the presets to just about anything, and you said, um, give me a different uh, face, and you just hammered the button, so it kept giving didn't. you, it kept giving you um, faces, no, sorry, it was similar faces. It was, if you, if you set it to give me a similar face, and you just kept hammering it, so it kept giving you similar faces, they just got yeah, more yeah. and more warped and more and more, like, fucked up. Because it would yeah, assume bro. that what you had was not what you wanted, and so it would keep changing there little go. things. got some wide chin there, wide chin. It was... Oh, you got some hideous things. Alright, so let's see... I went up with a green frog-looking man once. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Which is funny, because the character that I beat Dark Souls with was, like, this petite redhead girl. <laughs> Make it make her lips uh, small. Small. Well, do you want it to be motherly? The mother, the motherly godmother, 
What do you want out of be the godmother who you sleep with the fishes? The godmother looks like Marlon Brando. <laughs> no, that is actually, this doesn't look too bad. Yeah. That actually does look kind of Marlon Brando. Uh, yeah, it looks somewhat Marlon Brando. Okay, uh, so how do I change the name again? Uh, you go back. Back? That's a thing. Alright, uh, alright. Uh, square, sorry, yeah. Alright, Carly. So what, okay, so we're gonna start making up canon for the godmother. The godmother. Alright, what do you think her, what's her real, your real name is Carlina, is it? Carlina. Carlina the godmother. Alright, and where was she born? Corsica. Corsica. <laughs> no. Um, I, I know so, I know some Italian, <laughs> yeah, like Mexico. Uh, you don't want to capitalize G. You can just hit left trigger. Huh? <laughs> well, this is, e I'm finding this a little bit easier. Or I'm finding it more like, in <laughs> eh. wrong, wrong mother. Wrong again. We don't want any more copyright, now, do we? Yeah. Well, maybe if you stop mentioning Marlon Brando. <laughs> But he's so, but he's so good, how can we not? So you're an aged female military veteran called the Godmother. The Godmother. I, uh, I do fear Actually, yeah, let's give her a different backstory to, um... Yeah, does it compliment the Godmother? No, 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 give her a military veteran. I meant different to Marlon Brando. Oh, okay. Like, the Godmother was her call sign in the military corps. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She was like, a, she was one of Captain America. Her entire troop died. She was one of Captain America's boys. She was the only survivor from her troop. <laughs> so, Alright, so let's play some, uh, let's play some Bloodborne. <laughs> let's eventually play Bloodborne. Alright, I'm just saying thank God that we have the volume down for this. And the subtitles on, because we have the volume oh, down. Oh, the menu gets loud. The music on the menu is just so loud. Mm. Mm. Alright, do you want to close on the door? Please, sir. Yep. Yeah. Enjoy that. Yes, we. <laughs> and of course, my parents are home, so we don't want to get any more noise interference. Because that's all they are—just noise. All right. So, how much? So you've played a lot of uh, Bloodborne. How difficult would you say this is compared to Dark Souls? Uh, okay. Personally, interest. I found the individual enemies. Oh, okay. S mostly more difficult. Okay. They tend to att like when when the enemies in Dark Souls, uh, when they got larger and they hit harder, they still tended to be like they were they were either slow or they needed like a run up. Um, in this, even the bigger enemies can still like hit you really quickly, and they still hit you really really hard. Mm -hmm. Um, so I'd say that the normal enemies in this. Maybe not so much at the beginning, like the ones that I showed you in the little run mm. uh, at the beginning. They're probably... Oh, they're, oh, wow. They're not hard at all. Yeah, I know. Satan is coming out and is going to fuck me up. That's actually not an irregular enemy later. Ugh. Um, They drop good blood buffs. <laughs> well, it's just worth it for all the night terrors I'm going to be having for the next few weeks. Probably a bit more right now. Oh. It's like, I want to touch you. Oh, well, you can look, getting... but you can't touch. <laughs> but I, yeah, I'd, I'd say that the look normal. Look, but you can't touch. I'd say that for me, the normal enemies were probably somewhat more difficult, oh, God. just because they hit faster mm. and with more and like at the later levels when they're hitting with like more power. Oh God! They, yeah, exactly. Face. They still hit just as fast. Uh, I didn't whereas no, I was in uh, the on XCOM enemy unknown. Eh? Oh, they do look a little bit like that. But, um... Actually, I did it really bad. Yeah. I went straight from the godmother to, um, the toy Darians from Star Wars. Oh, yeah, let's not be racist. Let's not be racist, dude. But, yeah, even when they hit, even when enemies in this hit, like, end up hitting harder, they still hit just as fast. Okay. Whereas in Dark Souls, when they started hitting harder, they tended to get slower. Respect. Um... Scroll, see blood out to... Blood out to try to the hunt. So, I'd say that in, in, in general... Right. The, the regular enemies are more difficult in this than in Dark Souls, but with a couple Beware of exceptions, of women. Uh, you, you... I need a weapon or something? Nope. You can't get a weapon yet. Okay. Pretty? It's um, pretty pretty. It is, it is a very pretty game. Mm. But that's the thing, uh, but apart from a couple of exceptions, mm -hmm. I found the bosses in this 
much easier than Dark Souls. Right. Okay. What did you just... Ooh. Just a bit. Oh, you're... <laughs> you were two wielding hands. Whoa, that's that's weird. Looks like she's got, like, a her hand extended like Mr. Fantastic. Oh, oh Jesus. It's a hell of a lot. Yeah, I did... Yeah, the godmother did, uh, judo. And, yeah, thank you. Oh, that thing uh, shows you how someone died. Yeah, yeah. Scripture. Ooh. Remember, you can lock on by clicking in the right hand stick. Oh. Oh shit. I came so close to killing this the first time. Oh, shit. Okay. Welcome to Bloodborne. Yay. Real Dark Souls begins here. Yay! I did it. Okay, so yeah, yeah you. <laughs> fortunately for you, that is a fight that you are supposed to lose. All right. Well, I did pretty good. I thought I was gonna get. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do. Keep me in this game. Oh, okay. No. 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 You have a stamina bar. That mm. stamina bar runs out. Well, I thought I could dodge it. I thought I could dodge it. Man, some of this game is just so beautiful. Oh, it's very pretty. It's got kind of a kind of reminds me of one of the hammer the hammer films like like hammer those films? yeah they're like an old an old brand of films from the sixties from Britain uh, which Britain Britain you mean which, Britain Britain which were remakes of the Universal monster movies like uh, Dracula Frankenstein uh, okay uh, not Phantom of the Opera but yeah no because that, that of... wasn't an old movie um, no fan no uh, no Phantom of the Opera was pretty old like the one with uh, Lon Chaney Jr. Lon Chaney Jr. No, no, Lon Chaney. Just Lon Chaney, actually, Lon Chaney. Okay, I got a notebook. Cool. Yep, that you received from those little things. Alright, use scripture. Spectre. Spectre, whatever. Okay, turn around. Turn around. Yep, start running up the stairs and talk to those things that are giving you a weapon. No, not the doll. I Although you will talk to her later. Those uh, things. Uh, They're literally holding weapons up to you. I didn't see them, they're on the th how can I- oh, come on. They're holding up weapons. A trick weapon. Alright, so Okay, so, uh, the Hunter Axe does the most damage, but is the slowest. Mm. Threaded Cane, um, does... Uh, is very quick. It's one of the quickest weapons in the game. Mm. But by... God. It, just, it doesn't do that much it's, damage? It does- I- I-, I don't, some people have gotten it to do, like, great amounts of damage, and they're very, very good with it. I can. I have not been able to use it for shit. Uh, so the sword cleaver does a decent amount of damage. Is faster than the hunter axe, but slower than the threaded cane. Hmm. So it's like a medium weapon. Yeah. Uh, I picked the sword cleaver. Yeah. Um. That looks pretty. Yeah. I. I'm, I'll be honest with you. I picked the sword cleaver, and then made it a fair way through the game. Um, found the hunter axe in a different location. All right. The hunter axe and the saw spear. All right. And after that, I, 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 have not, I didn't use right. the saw cleaver for um, 90%. If I'm going to get into the mindset of the godmother, I think, the godmother. She, I think she wants an all-around weapon, so I'm going to go with saw cleaver. Sure. I feel like that, personally, for me, that was definitely the right choice at the beginning. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You ju oh, you fucking jackass. What? Oh, did I do You something? have five bullets and you don't have a gun. <laughs> Except gift messengers. Yes, they offer you a gun. Yay. The blunderbuss does a shotgun thing, Ooh. but it doesn't do as much damage. The hunter pistol is a single shot, mm. but um, it does more damage. Mm. It's kind of a toss up. If if you wanted to stun things, definitely blunderbuss. If you just want to like be getting things attention so you can draw them away from the group, mm. the pistol because the pistol has a longer range. Yeah. Alright, that sounds good. So you took the blunderbuster? I took the blunderbuster. If I was you, I'd turn around and just shoot it just to see how, like, the right, way it fires. Alright, so how do I get it? How do I get it? Alright, click uh, options. Uh, options. Yep. Then uh, one down. Uh, one down? That, yep. Uh, and that, yep. Alright. And, and then B, or rather circle. And then go to the one to the right, yep, that. Uh, and then circle. Uh, circle. Oh, wait, sorry. In the beginning. Oh, right, 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 right. Uh, Circle and then another one to the right. No, no, no. Up, up, right. Alright, uh, right. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Yeah. 
I, c I always forget that you can... The, yeah. The, yeah. Right, so how do I aim? Well, I mean, you're not really aiming at the moment because you you don't have anything to aim at. I just shoot it. Right. Just make sure you don't shoot it towards the doll. That's pretty cool. That, yeah, that, that probably doesn't help you in seeing how it shoots. Alright, then. Cool. See, it does, it do, it's got a spread. It's like a shotgun. Cool. Yeah, it's, it's alright. No. Alright. Personally, I used the pistol for ages. Uh, then you get a flame sprayer, mm -hmm. which is pretty cool. I you have no them. blood echoes, you cannot afford shit. <laughs> Maybe I can haggle. You have nothing. That's like saying... <laughs> that's, that's so convincing. That's why I'm so convincing. I'll oh, end up oh. paying me to take it. Oh god. Okay, I should get out of this so we can see the full beauty of the godmother. Uh, just get rid of that. Let's see the godmother in her full beauty. Ugh. <laughs> I feel like you should be playing some beta and like... Da 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 da! Da 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 da! Da 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 da! Alright, so do I open this? Okay, where do I go? Yeah, I feel like I'm such a noob right now. Hey, where do I go? Yeah, no. If, if I see you heading into danger that I'm like... That I think it is unfair that you're heading into, I'll tell you. But other than that, I think I'm gonna mostly just leave you and let, 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 let you on your own. Alright, cool. Alright. Hmm. Here's pretty... a hint. Spoiler warning for the next 20 seconds or so, by the way. That gate mm. uh, actually leads to the final two boss battles. Ah. Yeah, that game will that that will not open for the rest of the game until then. Okay. Boy, someone in the comments is just probably screaming at me right now. I assume there are people <laughs> who comment on our videos. I've seen at least one. <laughs> it like, may have been me. No, Actually, that's right. My friend did. That's even more pathetic. That was like, funny. That's even more pathetic. Yeah. It's like. You, I comment people... on my videos. No, no, no. no. I'm it's... popular. <laughs> okay, turn right. Turn right. Yeah. Uh, that's that's even more yeah, pathetic. Right. Like, you know how some people. No, get... I said right. You said right. Yeah. But here, okay. Like no, you, you jackass. But there. Okay, yeah, my head's done. Awaken at a selected location. Location, location in yeah. Yarnum. Okay. Yarnum is the mm. city place that you were in. All right, cool. The bad place. The bad place that I should. The bad, be. bad place. Uh, but you were yeah. awakened in uh, Yosefka's clinic, right? Yes. <laughs> and yes, I was a bit. You absolutely don't remember, do you? I don't. I'm pretty sure it's the only place that you have open. Uh, well, I'm assuming because it's the only place I've been in right now. It's the only. I'm like a newborn child who's just experiencing her, own, her first memories. Mm. Apart from her troubled past, that is. No, no, she wasn't troubled past, remember? Military veteran. Oh, okay. Well, except for military background then. Uh, why don't you have the saw equipped? Uh, because. I... That's not it. That's not it at all. Oh, no, no. Hit circle. Hit okay. circle. Yeah. Alright, thank you. Alright, Now, so... if you hit the left... Okay, before you go before you go into that, hit the left bumper, you can do that. Um, which gives you more range, but it's less powerful. Alright. So it is less powerful hitting like that. Alright. Um, yeah, so... That's pretty cool. And if you hit a uh, circle, you jump... By which I mean you dodge. Right. And right, you played Dark Souls, so you may get the wrong idea. If you're locked onto something, mm -hmm. uh, you do this dash that is like, it tries circling now. Alright. Okay, circling in a direction. Yeah, boy! Blood Echoes Retrieve. Cool. I walk up to it and loot his corpse. Does it still say pillage corpse? I uh, don't know. Look to the left, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Left. Item. Alright. I was talking less about that, but sure. Alright. So, yeah, um, I was gonna say before, like, most people who do Let's Plays have to worry about people commenting about, about how poorly they're doing at the game. We don't even get that. <laughs> we don't even get a How awful it is that you wish someone would comment on how bad you are yeah, playing the like, game. They're just like, eh, fucking whatever, they're not worth their time. You were just, just like, why? That's, uh, please. I hope you get invaded. Uh, what the hell do you mean by invaded? Nothing. No, don't, don't give up. up. Never give up. No, Never you, surrender. You, you do go out that door. 
Okay. That gate. The other gate you don't open until mm. pretty late in the game, actually. Okay. Alright, so... And only, only if you go up this path that is really easy to miss. Mm. The pathway of righteousness. Yeah, no, do you think but... the Do you think the Godmother is a law-abiding citizen? No, I think the Godmother is, like, a ass-destroying bitch. <laughs> <laughs> like she go, she's here to wreck shit and have fun. She is. Like, she's wasted. <laughs> she's she's wasted. so drunk right now. Is that the Hit backstory? X, that's really annoying me. Is that is that her backstory? She just got plastic and just wandered in here. Well, I mean, not just that. I mean, obviously, yeah, you might want to turn around. That dude's gonna attack you. Oh, I'm thinking um, so far. That's pretty good. Yeah, she lost her whole troop. Then she like w decided to go on a holiday somewhere. She got plastered and she woke up here. <laughs> That's what she sounds like. Yes, that dude can. is gonna wake up. You know, hit him a few times, and then the guy to your left woke up. That, that dude sounds like a godfather. And that, no. And that should be, um, that's why she sounds like the way she does. That's why she's always there doing that. There was an item back there. There was? Okay. Yes. You even looked at a thing that said item awaits ahead. Uh, uh, Roll. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, there we go. Hey, I've never played. This is my first time playing the X. The PS4. I think that's it. Xbox. Oh yeah. Search by. Cool. Oh, so it does say search. Oh yeah. All right. So we get the lever. Yes. Pull the lever. Now guess what happens? I am going to die. I'm die. Die horribly. You know what I found out real recently that I never realized? What? Isma from uh, Emperor's New Groove. Do you know who she's played by? Earth Kit. Yeah. She's yeah. played by OG Catwoman. Yeah, OG Catwoman. That's what the hell? That's cool, isn't it? Oh, okay, yeah. Now, okay, destroy those things. That's really cool. Why are I you know, going that way? I don't know. Because I don't know where A I ladder about. dropped. What? Where you, you pulled the lever and a ladder dropped. Okay. You watched it drop. Like, I didn't see well, it. Well, this can't possibly be <laughs> the way It forward. blended into the background. Oh, it did it! I swear I to God. I found it my first run. <laughs> yeah, I was like, bam! Pull the lever. I was bam, distracted a by the gothic scenery. I it was on sightseeing. Although, like, just quickly, uh, actually, can I have the control for just yeah, a second? Sure. Use the godmother to better use. This is something use. that I noticed. Uh, where is it? The sky. Okay, well, apparently we're in Mordor. Yeah, I know, right? No, there's um. There. Okay. There is. Oh, God damn it. There's a sunset? No. There's a. S damn, I can't see where it is. Why can't I see where it is? It's a church bell? No, there's somewhere. Where there's a. There's a couple of places where you can see it. There it is. Where you can see a scene in the sky. Oh, yeah, I can. I can see it. I can see yeah, it. Yeah, right. Like, right. There, where my head is, you can see it sort of. Yeah, I think I see it. Anyway, um. But there's another place where you can see okay. it. Okay. Uh, really mm. Oh, yeah. Yes. I was about to say thank you, Simon. Friend. Does that open for the gate? Okay. If you say so. Right. Man, the audience is going to be pissed! Because I'm just doing so bad. You know bonfires in the last game? Oh god, I, where, where, where is it? There are no bonfires in this game. Okay, so what did it happen? What well, there are, are lanterns! Ah, okay, cool. Cool, so you will now respawn there. Uh, you can use those to walk back to uh, the little house where the doll and all the gravestones were. Okay. Okay. But, um, one thing that I know several uh, reviewers and a lot of people who play Dark Souls had an issue with, mm -hmm. you can't, uh, in late Dark Souls game, and in Dark Souls 2, um, you could walk from any bonfire to any other bonfire. Okay. But here you can. In this, you have to go back to the little, uh, in-between worlds place. Alright. Oh, I remember this place. In this, you, yeah. In this, you have to go to the little green room. To the little, I, I don't want to say the little green room between worlds because that's how their punctuation put it. Nice, you got all their attention. No, I didn't. I just got um, the one guy. Maybe you can lock on. Okay. 
Um. You, bro. And remember triangle to heal. Um. But yeah, you can go back to the little uh, waiting room uh, between universes. Yeah, see, I changed the wording. That means it's not, you know, stealing from him, right? Um, you can go back to the to the little house, to the little house that I had before. By um, you can walk there from the lantern, but you can't. But you have to walk there, and then from there use one of the gravestones to walk to a lantern that you've been to before. Slowly, okay, no, not slowly. Now, that doesn't mean that much to you now. Uh, turn around, by the way. Oh, I he's lying on the ground, and then when you pass him, he stands up, and after a few seconds, he starts to shoot you. Nice. Uh, um, sneaky, sneaky. When this game came out, <laughs> people, the reason, one of the big reasons people got really up in arms about it was because you had to do, you had to walk between here and that place, and then that place and where you wanted to go. And the loading times when this game came out were up. Holy. Okay, I'm just gonna go run away for a little bit so they don't. I'm um, just like it. Okay. Okay, now it's not what one. time is it? Uh, we've got like. It's about eight, but we got like that. You got ages. Yeah, we got three minutes. No, oh, three minutes until like third minute mark. Oh, we're gonna cut this off in ten minutes? Yeah. Oh, oh shit. Yo, please. Oh, you grew. Oh yeah, you, uh, if you get hit, um, for a little while after you get hit, you can regain some of that by hitting them back. Okay. Did you notice that? Yes, I did. So this one actually rewards, like, going full... This one rewards going, like, full on, like, violent. Alright. You is dead. Nope. Okay. I, I tried. Just still shoot. Alright. So, well, the godmother is a little bit rusty, but she's a little bit, um, enembered. That, angered. that weapon. The beast roar? That weapon, the beast roar. What's, a, what's wrong with this? It's such a pain to get. Uh, okay. You can only find it in, um, okay, so this does a thing, this does a thing called chalice dungeons. Okay. Where, basically, you make your, it makes a dungeon at random. Um... And I've gone, and you can. The only place that you can get the beast draw is in one of those dungeons. Hey, bro. Oh, oh but it's, God. Like, it's a very uncommon drop. Jeez, those dudes look like zombies. Wow. Okay. Well, those dudes look kind of like zombies. The dudes with the shields look like werewolves. See? Oh, yeah, they do. The wolves, but... <laughs> They're all Michael J. Fox. Yeah. That's the big twist. Like, it's like that, uh, it's Michael J. Fox disease. Oh, yeah, no, Oh, God, right. that's, that's bad terminology. Oh, Michael J. Yeah. Fox disease. <laughs> Jeez. You mean Parkinson's, right? <laughs> okay, I'm I'm sorry. To, I was trying to be subtle about I it. Love, I, love, I love Michael J. Fox. I have an enormous amount of respect for that. Oh, God, yes. Like, fact, not, uh, like, if I had the godmother, I could date him on the box. His disease and his acting, just like everything oh, God, that God, man God. has done. Oh, tell me about it. Like, didn't he appear in an episode of Scrub one time? Yeah, he did. Yeah. Although I th think that was before Parkinson's. Okay. Because he, he did this thing with his hand. Uh, he, like, you know how some people can, like, move a coin, like, really quickly in between fingers? Uh, yeah. He did that. Wow. Oh. Yeah. It was this whole thing of, uh, there was, there was a whole plot point about, remember, the dude behind you will turn around and start shooting you. Alright. Hey, bro. Um, yeah, it was this whole plot point where a guy wasn't sure if he should, um... He really admired him because he was so dexterous. That didn't go so well. See what I mean about like it really doesn't do that much damage. Yeah. Fire, burn, burn! Okay, um, okay, we just ran out of time. Fire, hot! <laughs> fire, burn! <laughs> why, why fire hot? <laughs> the fire is worse than the thought, man. <laughs> okay, we're out of time here. 
Okay. Well, All right, well. Th this has been fun. Hopefully we'll come back and play maybe a longer stretch at some yeah. point. Fun fun for us, but probably not so fun for you guys. Oh, it's great fun. I, ugh, It's very equal parts fun and incredibly frustrating to watch you do this. <laughs>